Hey there, everybody. In this episode, episode, I'm going to show you how to do queries and filters. So you should have this all looking pretty good. We've got all 64 teams with wins, losses, winning percentages, all right there. Uh, this we calculated in a formula, and if you're not sure how to do that and how to color code them, there's a link popping up above. So what we're going to do is we're going to separate all of these by regions. The first thing I want to encourage you to do is go here, down here to where it says all teams. You might have already renamed yours, but I'm going to just rename mine to just teams. And then if you haven't made your pivot table counting up the number of teams from the different states, ahead and a, there's a previous video that's there too. Uh, we're going to add four more tabs because there are four regions in March Madness. So we're going to go ahead and hit the plus button and rename this to Midwest and do one per region. All right, next thing we're gonna do is we are going to label some of these ranges. Now, working with spreadsheets is a lot like Battleship. You've got like A1 in this cell, and this is J1 here, and all the way down here is G14. So, to make life a little bit simpler, we're going to just name these different rows and data sets and things like that. So. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to call this top entire row a header. So I'm going to click on row one. I'm going to go to data and I'm going to go to name the range, name ranges. And I'm going to call that header. I'm not going to capitalize anything because I really I don't want it to get confused and, and case sensitive. So I'm leaving everything lowercase. Hit done. Um, next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight all of these. I'm going to go um, columns A through, I'm going to even going to do J just in case there is a future assignment that needs column J. I'm going to hit add range and I'm going to call this just data. It's going to cover all of the data that we might need. And since I said we're going to make different um, regions, go ahead and highlight column C, hit add range, and call this region. Again, all lowercase, hit done. All right, we don't need that anymore. Let's go, let's just start with the Midwest or whatever your first one is. Um, so standing, starting right up here, we're gonna do what's a, qu a query. A query grabs information from another um, spreadsheet. So we go equals query, Q U R. Uh, U E R Y. Go ahead and hit enter and then type the word header and hit enter, and you'll see it just brings that in information all in. Um, if I were to change this to the word data, it would just bring in everything. Well, we don't want all of that, we just want the header. And here, we want to create a filter so we're going to go equals filter and we want all of the data we want it to look at all of the data we're going to go comma region you can go ahead and click on that equals and in quotes we're going to type midwest close 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 parentheses hit enter and it's going to bring this all in um Real quick, we just want to format it. So I'm going to highlight this. I'm going to hit bold. I'm going to highlight all of these. I'm going to double click that. Um, I'm going to even center everything. And I'm going to do a conditional format like we did in a previous video where I go um, format, conditional format, color scheme. I want to change my maximum to green. I want to change my minimum to red. And I want to change my 50 percentile to yellow. All right. 
And you might be asking, like, why, why not just copy and paste everything? Well, let me show you. If we go, if I find a Midwest team and I say uh, Illinois, let's say Illinois lost. So we add a loss to theirs, and that makes them 27 and 7. It changes that to 76%. When we go here, it changes it here and it changes it here. So we can't edit any of this, but we can edit the main sheet. All right, now that you've got the first one done, the rest are very, very similar. So the nice thing here is you can go to South, you can hit Equals, Query, Enter, Header, Enter, brings it in. You can go Equals, Filter, Data, Comma, Region, Equals, remember the quotes, um, South, I believe everything is case sensitive. So if you're using a lowercase s, I don't think it will work. And then we want to do some formatting like we've done in the previous set of uh, directions. Uh, one thing I do want to show you before I uh, stop recording here is we do want to I, I can even show you a faster way uh, to do this so in this next group let's say all right I want to just copy and paste this right so I just control highlight this control C go to the east make sure I'm in a1 paste it there brings it in if I go to e2 I highlight my formula here. I paste it there, but I'm in my east bracket, so I want to just change that word south east, and you can see it does it right there for you. So go ahead and format all of this. Uh, don't forget to do your um, formula for query and filter in your west one also and please format each of these to have um, bold headers in conditional format here thanks for watching and let me know if you have any questions